Hey guys, good morning and welcome to Morning Moments with Shane. As you can see, it's actually nighttime. Um, I'm filming at night tonight because I had a very early morning this morning and it is about 11.30 my time, uh, California time, and I uh, am tired so I might sleep past my regular Morning Moments with Shane. Um, so we talked about the negative effects of sugar uh, and we've been talking about immunity. So today we wanna to talk about how sugar affects your immunity. You know, and um, it does, it does in a big way. In some of the uh, biggest ways it inhibits the white blood cell functions and white blood cells are literally our body's first line of defense. Sugar keeps white blood cells from literally eating up bad bacteria. Uh, sugar is mucus forming, uh, so it can be hard to get rid of coughing or phlegm if you're consuming a lot of sugar. And that's Mr. Bronx making the noise behind me, he's excited at home. So sugar replaces vitamin C within your system. Vitamin C is a major antioxidant plays a huge part in helping white blood cells uh, eat up all of this bacteria. So when we overconsume and have too much sugar in our bloodstream, white blood cells cannot do their job. White blood cells look for vitamin C and they find sugar instead, which makes them, renders them a lot less effective. So what can we do? We need to reduce, reduce, and reduce. Um, you know, we need to cut back our sugar. So, you know, the easiest way that I think you can do it is if you just look at the one object or the one thing you eat that has the most sugar. Start with that. Don't start with absolutely everything. It's too much. You know, we're starting with little manageable size, little things that you can do, things that you can make you get ahead and get you going in the right direction. So, for example, um, water or tea instead of soda if you're a soda drinker. Um, you know, black coffee instead of uh, caramel macchiatos or anything else you might get at Starbucks. You know, fruit instead of pastries in the morning. These are all things you can start. You know, like I said, just start small and start manageable. Anyways, I want to thank you for tuning in, um, and I hope that this was some valuable information to get you on your way to getting your immune system built up by decreasing your sugar intake. Anyway, stay tuned for Morning Moments with me on how we can boost your immunity. We'll be doing them all week, as we always do, and I hope you guys had a good sleep. I know that I'm about to. Good night. Goodbye for now.